This episode of Indie Mogul is brought to you by The Final Destination. Get ready for the ultimate 3D trip on August 28th. Indie Mogul. Hey everyone, welcome to Backyard Effects, the best special effects tutorial show in the world. This week we're showing you how to create a car crash effect without ruining your vehicle or killing your actor. This week we're kicking off a three-part Final Destination Death Extravaganza. That's right, for the next three weeks we'll be showing you how to create some truly awesome special effects and bring you a three-part mega test film. One story, three effects, and three gruesome deaths. Actually, it's even more people die, like ten. Well. Our first death effect is a car crash, and here to find out how much we have to spend is Gary. The portable DIY green screen we built in the previous episode, a quiet and controlled area to drive, one car to be the impact car, and another vehicle to be the victim's car. Thanks to the Fastlane Daily guys, our victim's car was a shiny red Ferrari. But fear not, your mom's Ford Taurus will work just as well. Premonitions, visions, signs. We're all gonna die, all right? It's gonna be a crash. You saw it before it actually happened. On August 28th. I saw clues as to how the next person was going to die. What do you mean, the next person? Get ready. I think we can stop it. For the ultimate three-day trip. Look out! The final destination. Oh, Rated R. Take the trip in 3D to the end select theater. Simple time now! Woo! This project is rated skill level 4. The principles of this effect are simple, and if you do it right, safe too. First, you need to set up your camera on a tripod so that you can see your actor in the car as well as the impact car in the background. Take some time to get the framing right, then lock down your camera. Pull the victim's car into place, then set up your DIY green screen as far back as you can. The green screen needs to get behind anything that will move in the shot, like your actor. If you have a green screen big enough to cover the whole background, all the better. Try and avoid any green spill on shiny surfaces as this will create more work for you in editing. Shoot all your scenes with the victim's car, including your actor reacting to a fake impact. You are now done with this car and your actor, and we can move on to the impact car. Slowly pull the impact car up to the front of the camera. On a closed road, drive the car along your predetermined course, but in reverse. Now we're ready for editing. The simple way to create this effect is to key out the green, take the footage of your impact car, reverse it, and speed it up. Add this footage behind your actor and time it out so the impacts line up. Then just cut to black right at the moment of impact and add some wicked sound effects. If you have more experience with After Effects, you can spice up your impact even more. Whether you use the simple method or go crazy with digital extras, you now have a fun, cheap, and safe way to create a car crash. We should have eaten that cake today. We should be dead. But I changed Death's plan. And Death is pissed. Remember to be extra careful when dealing with the car, especially when you're driving in reverse. We actually blocked off the road and had crew members around the perimeter with walkie-talkies. Big thank you to our sponsor, The Final Destination, in theaters August 28th. You need some drop buttons for your next action film. You need to get one of these. 